Well, it's Sunday and I've been down here in Mount Barker since Tuesday. Everybody's turned up now. We've got two new trailers that we're going to be taking with us to Esperance. Uh, not, not myself, obviously, I've got the Travelander, but one of our friends has a new Parks 13. Um, what do they call it? A hybrid camper. And we've got another mate who's been making his own trailer that he calls the Tramper. And uh, it's got a couple of quads on the back and a, and a tent arrangement, which uh, you'll probably see a bit later on. It's going to take us about five hours to get to Esperance uh, at best, maybe a bit longer. The, um, the Parks 13 has been a bit unstable towing for some reason. We're not 100% sure what's going on with that. We're going to try redistributing some of the water around between the front and rear tanks and maybe take the spare tyres off the back and put them in the back of the ute just to see if that stabilises it a bit. But we might be in for a bit of a longer run. We'll see how we go. Uh, everything else is going good. The weather's finally cleared up and it's actually a beautiful day here. We've had some absolutely horrific weather. It's been very wet, very windy and super cold down here. So we're looking forward to a little bit of nicer weather when we get there to Esperance. to Esperance, it took us about seven hours. Uh, the parks was a little bit better, uh, it wasn't swaying so much. We moved the tires further forward um, rather than hanging them off the back uh, and we emptied the tanks about halfway to take a little bit of the weight out of the rear tank. Our plan for today is to head out to Cape Le Grand and have a look at the tourist sites out there and maybe if we get time to the tourist drive on the other side of town.
Well, it's our last day in Esperance today, and uh, we're going to be heading out to Fanny's Cove. Have a look around there. detour to Moyer's homestead. Um, there's quite a few ruins here. We're going to go have a little bit of a look around. The bees are quite friendly here, so if you're allergic to bees, you want to be pretty careful. And the track's pretty rough here, and there's not really a sand track. It's just limestone and pretty bumpy and corrugated. Anyway, we'll go have a look. We've had a great time in Esperance, some beautiful scenery down here. We're going to pack up today and head off to Hyden where we're going to stay overnight at Wave Rock on the way back to Perth. 